fuck are you? You know me. Well, you did. What do you want from me? I want to watch you suffer for what you did to me. I don't even remember you. <laughs> don't worry. You soon will. My men will be coming over to your house. They've been told not to hurt you unless you resist. Then they will have to subdue you somehow. But they won't kill you. Hello? Hello? Shit. Hey Maya, you ready to record? Brad. Shit, Brad, this isn't the time for screwing around. We've got a problem. Whoa, Maya, you sound scared. What the hell is going on? Brad, I just got docked. What the hell? Someone, I don't know who he is, just tried asking for sex. I told him no. Then he sent me all my personal information. He called me and said there were people on the way. And that they'll hurt me if I resist. <laughs> Shit. Shit. Alright. Do you still have that 9mm I gave you for your birthday last year? Yeah. Kept it under the bed. Ever since you said no to use it unless absolutely necessary. And in this case, this is such a time. Shit. Brad, I see headlights. Shit, bro wasn't lying. Shit, do you need me to book flights? By the time you get here, I would have escaped them already. Fair. I'll just stay on the call. Alright. Boss wants us to take her in alive. But if she puts up a fight, we can damage her a little bit. Let's go then. You hidden? Yeah. Just keep. Hello. In case they come in the house. Go! Go! Get out of her now! Maya, you okay? Hey, yeah. I'm okay. So long as you're okay. Are they still chasing you? Go, go, go! The house. If I'm not mistaken, then where I heard them from, I'm Oh shit. May God have mercy on their souls. Guys, I think there's something. Hmm, shit. Sounds like they met Frank. Seems like they're running back to the house. All four of them. Good. Wait. What did you just say? Scary me. Okay. Don't panic. One of them might still be in the house. Gotcha! <laughs> Maya! 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 You little bread! You... You son of a bitch! You put her... You bring her back to her house right now, or I'll... You'll do what exactly? Cause I know who you are, bread! Listen, I don't know who you are. I don't know what you want. If you want a ransom, I ain't got no money. But what I do have is a set of skills. Skills I acquired from a previous life. And if you let her go now, then the e we can end this all tonight. However, if you don't end this, tonight, end this right now, let's just say I will find you and I will make you beg for mercy. Come and get me. Wow. Hey. Is everything okay? It's Maya. What about her? She's been kidnapped. What? 
By who? I don't know. But I'm taking a flight to Brisbane to find her. By the time you get there, wouldn't the kidnappers be long gone? Yeah, they may have a head start. But my skills won't let them run far. Right. I know how much she means to you, Brad. But do me a favor and stay safe. Come home to me and don't be dead. I'll be back as soon as I can. I promise. Andy, is the jet ready? Good evening, sir. Yes, sir. Although I couldn't get transportation for you while you're over east, so you may have to resort to more public means. So long as the jet is ready, everything else I can handle. Now to find Maya. Yes, I do hope for Miss Connolly's safety. So do I, Andy. So do I. Who are you? You still don't remember me? That's a shame. I thought you would by now. You'll learn soon enough who I am. Brad, Brad knows I'm missing. He'll come for me. I know he will. I'm counting on it. Cole, this is a crime scene. You can't be here. Huh. Western Australia. What brings you all the way out here? Family. Can I join the search at all? Sure. There isn't much to search, though. We've about nearly done everything. What have you found? Well, the usual things you'd find at a kidnap crime scene. Gunshots, things thrown around, and tire tracks. Where did the tire tracks lead? Officer Stone over there had them tracked. They go all the way to the end of the property and just disappear. Can you tell me something? What is it, officer? We weren't told about anyone from out of state being in this investigation. So why the hell are you here? You're here for the girl who lives here. That's what you meant by family, isn't it? It is. Do you have an issue with it? Seeing as you are a professional PI, my partner looked up your name on file. We'll allow you to work with us, but as far as we're concerned, buddy, I start playing the poor girl's funeral. Beep! Beep! Hello? Hello, Brad. You must be the one behind all of this. How'd you know? I'm an ex-military officer. I know what you used to do. We did it together, Brad. Do you remember 1994? All right, men! This is dangerous territory! If we're found by any of the Taliban, will be shut down, and it's every man for himself. Is that clear? Hoorah! Ow, ow, ow! Get out of the vehicle. Get out of the vehicle. You do not want to die for this shit! Wait, why are you doing this? Shut up! Shut the fuck up! Come on, let's move! Frank? Frank? Frank, thank goodness you're alive. What is wrong, Brad? Frank, it's Maya. She's been taken. No. Did they? I thought I scared them off. <coughs> Wait. That symbol. I've seen it before. What is it? Well, what is it? It's a Black Hawk. My old task force from 1994. Whoever this is truly knows my past. Did we get the files? Yeah, we did. Now go! Alright, where to next? We get to the chopper and we get the hell out of here! And hey, after this, maybe you can finally retire, Brad. That's the plan. That is the plan. This cannot be right. Somebody is screwing with me. So, Maya, this is the project you said you were working on. It's been almost 10 years since you told me about this. I gotta see if it runs. Beep. Hello? Hello again, Brad. 
You son of a bitch. I hope you burn in hell. Oh, come on, Brad. Is that any way to speak to your old friend? I'm not an old friend. I don't even know who the hell you are. You'll remember soon enough. Both of you will. Then I'll kill you both. Until then, the house is rigged to blow in 30 seconds. I get out if you can. Toodaloo. I'll be in touch. This shit's getting out of hand. I can't do this on my own. Whoever he is, he knows too much. But the question is, does he know my team? What the fuck? Fuck! Shit! And fuck you too! Open up the back, Connor. I got a plan to get him off our app. Tony, it's been a long time. Brad, it sure has. Seems you've done well for yourself. Working for the Australian government has its benefits. Who is this? Dear, this is an old friend. This is Brad. He was our brigade leader. Brad, this is John, my husband. Nice to meet you, John. It seems that someone could finally tie Tony down, seeing as that back in Afghanistan, no one could. It's a joke, mate. Have you got a wife yet, Brad? I have a girlfriend back home. Kayla, her name is. Good to hear. Glad someone could tie you down, too. Don't mind me asking, why exactly are you here? Actually, yeah, that is a good question. While I enjoy you dropping by, there must be a reason. Given I haven't seen you since 1994. It's Maya. She's been taken. What? Maya... Taken? What? Taken by who? I don't know. All I know is a few days ago, she was taken right from her house. And whoever did it, he knows me, and he knows I'm after them. After they blew up the house, I have the cop and the cops have no leads. Shit. So, you thought of coming to me? I thought if anyone was going to be able to help me hunt this person down, it was going to be you. Follow me. You think this is enough? This is plenty. Let's suit up! Everybody, out now! What the hell are we doing here? Where's the chopper? At the back. Come on. Brad, Tony, Connor, welcome. What the fuck is this? He's here. What do you want us to do? I think you both know what to do. Connor. I'm sorry. Who is it? Be careful. It could be him. Hello. Hello again, Tony. Who the hell are you? Oh, come on, Tony. You don't remember me. No, I really don't. Who are you? Oh, well, you soon will. Once your house blows up. What? Gotta go. Bye. You have 30 seconds. What was it? We gotta go. Now. Hey, Tony. Does your neighbor have a van that they park out your prop on your property? No. What the hell? Why? Because I just saw someone get into a postal van. I think I found our guy. Then let's get on it. Sir, we aren't going to outrun them in this thing. This thing was built in Japan. It is not as, the same as a Russian engine. Of course not. We're a postal van. You need to help maneuver them. Watch out for the landmines! I think I got the hunt. Shit, forget about John. it! He's dead! We need to keep moving now! Shit! 
Brad, thank fuck you found me. <sighs> you really think I wouldn't? True. Here, take this! You found my 9 mil? It was on the ground of your house. Alright. Now that you two are reunited, I can finally stop this charade. <laughs> what the fuck, Tony? I've been waiting nearly 30 years for that. After all we did for you, after we sacrificed to pull you out of Afghanistan? Did you try to pull Connor out? Or Kevin? Both of them died. Connor was a liability. Kevin, however, that was not planned. He died only because the Taliban got to him. Kevin had a life ahead of him, and you let it be taken. Connor? Well... He was our friend. Connor was mentally unstable. The boss gave us orders to execute him when it came the time for the campaign to end. And you were there with me. You agreed to do it! Doesn't mean I enjoyed watching our old friends, a lifeless corpse on the ground. Do you even hear yourself? My god, we are Black Hawks. We can't feel for anyone. We were doing this as Boss told us. Sure, it wasn't a plan for Kevin to die, but some things we have to accept. Really? That was the bond you have with Maya? What? Sure, it's not the loving, sexy friendship. But there's definitely a father-daughter bond you've got. So don't tell me about feelings and emotions, Brad, because it's complete and utter bullshit. Bravo, bravo. I can see you getting so close to the answer, Brad. I can see you just chipping away to find out who I am and what I'm doing. Just by what Tony has told you. Oh yeah, kind of easy. Tony told us you died, as we did watch you die in the Taliban. Did you though? At this rate, I'm not even sure. I don't know... I don't know what. It's been 30 years and you've been planning this. I knew you had a, I knew I had superior battle knowledge and strength, but all you wanted was getting back at Maya for bringing us to Afghanistan. So, if I had to guess, you're Kevin. You're... You're, you're gonna clip me, Brad? Boss gave us orders. You're a liability, Connor. I'm sorry. Well... To get it over with! Connor Bra, I hereby release you of your duties. Rest in peace, my brother. How the hell did you know that it was Kevin? It's simple. I was the one to kill Connor. That and Connor knew nothing about me. Or the plans as we, as the boss deemed him a liability and didn't want him to know anything. Kevin, however, the unplanned death, therefore he and I both knew the plan. I mean, my only question is, Kevin, how did you survive? You really think that shot to the head was real? Hello, sir. So I take it our plan worked? Well, I shot you, and I dropped your body as dead weight, as you predicted they would. Good. Now, we need to work on finding their homes, and in due time, we exact our revenge. How the hell did you know that it was Kevin? It's simple. I was the one to kill Connor. That and Connor knew nothing about me, or the plans as, we, as the boss deemed him a liability and didn't want him to know anything. Kevin, however, the unplanned death... Therefore, he and I both knew the plan. I mean, my only question is, Kevin, how did you survive? You really think that shot to the head was real? Hello, sir. So I take it our plan worked? Well, I shot you and I dropped your body as dead weight, as you predicted they would. Good. Now, we need to work on finding their homes, and in due time, we exact our revenge. So why go through all this mess? Why do you need revenge? I want the power of hybrid- What? I know Maya is a secret agent working for Mabel and Lex Danvers. 
I know that the Blackhawks was a ploy for them. You had the powers of a hybrid. You were the failed experiment out of that. The issue is, as well, you don't know the first thing about being one. Whatever you say, I would make a great one. And I wouldn't cover them up. Give up, Brad. I will become a hybrid. Trust me, Kevin. You don't want to be a hybrid. It is not worth the sacrifice to lose your humanity just for the powers it gives you. You just need to be stronger. Which I am stronger than you. I guess we'll have to see about that. Don't do it, Brad. Please don't kill me. You need me. I'd be the best hybrid. You won't be one because you're strong. But you'd also be insane. Just like Connor was. If you won't let me be one, then I'll kill you for your power instead. You shot him? He was really starting to piss me off. <laughs> he didn't fully piss you off earlier? Well, yeah, he did, but... I mean, he really was starting to get on my nerves, especially when he was using me to get to you. I mean, come on, bro couldn't be pettier if he tried. I mean, you're right. He was my best friend at the academy. I didn't think he would go as far as he did. And I mean, trust me. You don't want the powers of a hybrid. It really isn't worth it. It's why I left Mabel. Oh, by the way, how's Kayla? She's good. Well, from the last I saw her. Are you finally going to ask her to marry you? Well, that was going to happen before I found out you were taken. This was interesting, but I'm glad that it's over now. <sighs> I think it's time to go back home. I don't think you can. Your house just, uh, kind of blew up. Come back with me to WA. I might be able to help you. Really? You got anywhere else to be? No. Let's go. <laughs> What the hell? Brad, I think your house is trashed. <laughs> Kayla? Kayla? Kayla! <laughs> Who the hell is this? <laughs> Hello, Brad. Remember me? You son of a bitch! How the hell are you alive? Yeah, I'm alive. With the pain and misery of a dead, pissed off man! Where the hell is Kayla? If you touch her, I'll... You'll do what exactly? I know who you are, Brad. Unlike Kevin, who only knew you for a short period of time, the Black Hawk days. I knew you from before the Academy, when we were kids, when we were in Mabel. I know how you think, how you act. I know everything about you. But again, unlike Kevin, I'm not gonna hide behind a mask. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm gonna make sure you know who's causing you this immense pain and suffering in order for you to see how we are precious Kayla again. You're gonna need to come back to where it first started. And I don't mean Afghanistan. You know exactly where to find me, don't you? I'm coming after you, you sick bastard! What happened? Who's got Kayla? What's going on? Come on, we're going. Going where? We're going to Ireland. <laughs>